<laughs> you fucking bitch. I'm going home with my car. <laughs> you should see the face of Zlatan. Like, you fucking bastard. <laughs> Dus uh, ik heb mijn tijd niet gezien. Er wel uh, gesproken over de telefoon, maar ja, ik hoop uh, dat hij in de auto past. <laughs> Tegen lijn. Nee, maar uh, ik heb hem lang niet gezien, dus ik ben benieuwd uh, hoe het met hem gaat. Yes, we gaan kijken. Ciao. Hij zit vast op Liedmanen en Van der Meijden is weg. Moens twijfelt, staat nu voor zijn goal. Van der Meijden, prachtige bal Bido. 2-1. Een buitengewone start van dit competitieduel. Het is de vierde grote kans in deze wedstrijd. Mido weer. En nu hangt hij. Drie kopballen gingen er niet in. De vierde wel. Van der Meijden. Komt buiten. Helemaal deze paal. Prachtige goal, Mido. Hij mag er niet in in die hoek, hoor je dan te zeggen, maar hij zit er wel in. En dit duo zorgt voor de gelijkmaker van Ajax. Oh, kanaal. Aan die, you fucking joker. How are you? Oh, yeah, good. Good, good. Good to see you. Are you alone here? Yeah. Oh, it's good, man. Go out tonight. No, no. Please, I go. I go. You have this on? Yeah, of course. Hello, brother. How are you, man? You good? Yeah, good, man. You? How's the family? Good, good. You're a fucking TV star now. <laughs> huh? They kick you out of the TV so you go digital. Yeah, but I have to, I have to make money. I have to make money. Uh, okay. Why are you here? I'm here. Uh, I'm here to watch the Ajax final game. Yeah. And then uh, have a meeting with Ajax uh, the next day on Monday. Yeah. Uh, Why oh, you stay here for a few days? Yeah, I leave on Tuesday. Yeah. Uh, yes, uh, yesterday you were in uh, Saudi Arabia. Yeah, I was working on the game. You know, I do a lot of TV work in yeah. the Middle East. And I do some TV work with Sky Sports in uh, in England and BBC as well. So Good next man. week we're coming to. I'm going to do a TV program with Jamin Jenas. We're so doing a lot. Jamin Jenas, you remember? Jamin? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're doing a lot of TV work. Doing my coaching badges. I'm almost done with my A with the okay. UEFA. Okay. Yeah. And then you become I'm trainer. I have been already. Yeah, I know. Zamalek, eh? Zamalek and Ismaili, yeah. And you win? Cup yeah. champion? I won the, we won the cup in the first year. Second year, we, we reached the quarterfinal of the, of the champion, African Champions League. Oh. And uh, we became second in the, in the league. So, it's done all right. I love coaching. I never, yeah, I, yeah. I, I never thought that I would love coaching. Oh, I hate it, man. Fuck, it's nothing for me. I did also my badges, but shit. Dude. It's too serious for me. <laughs> <laughs> I have to be assistant. So when you get coach, make me assistant. I, I can learn and make crosses. The, the only thing you can do in football is to become a kit man. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, that's the only the only job that suits you. Yeah, you will be Why water, you come from here? water boy. Water boy. Yes. Why did <laughs> you, you come from here? Ball boy, you call it. <laughs> ah, look at this guy. Yeah, beautiful. Ah. Hey, fuck it up. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then, I'm gonna be your assistant. You're gonna be a kit man, I told you. Uh, that's no problem. Yeah. If you pay good money, good I come. Good money, good money. Yeah, yeah, no problem. A few millions. <laughs> 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 so, uh, you have three kids now? Uh, three boys, yeah. Three boys, eh? They play football? They play football. Two of them are good, yeah. doing well. Yeah. And the oldest one, uh, I, got a, I got a 14 year old boy, the oldest one. Ali. Ali, yeah. Next year, we'll send him to England. Put him in a, in, a, in a proper club if he can. If he can, we will see. Oh, okay. So last year we got him. Uh, we got him out in the summer in England, and he did all right. The coaches were happy with him. So next year we we'll put him in England. Yeah. We will see. Hopefully he will be all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's good. He's striker. Yes. Oh, good. Tall, good. Right-footed. Good crosses. <laughs> <laughs> You, lost you weight, remember, eh? you remember when Travelsi when Travelsi came with the with the with the small car with the small. <laughs> yeah, but let's, let's make jokes. <laughs> 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 what Travelsi? With the Kanta? 
It was a Kanta? No. The red one, the little red car. The one that could go everywhere. The one that we, he, he, he couldn't come up on the, on the, <laughs> on the ramp of the arena. <laughs> He came, he pushed the gas, <laughs> and he stopped in the middle, you remember? <laughs> you told me that story, man, fucking hell, but he, he's, he went crazy, eh? He went crazy later. No, no, it's good now. No, no, no. He, he's, he's, he's I see like, him in, in Manchester. I see him, we had SLA, Mercedes, Mercedes. <laughs> Hope that dude. <laughs> I look, I look, no, and I look not. again, fucking hell, I had them. <laughs> hey! <laughs> no, no, he's alright, man. Yeah, he's good man. He, he's oh, good he was a good player. Yeah, yeah. yeah, unbelievable. The best right back. Yeah. I think but he was so unlucky, you know, with his injuries. He, he he signed with Liverpool and Arsenal and he failed medical in both clubs. And he, he was just unbelievable. He just, <laughs> I remember his first game at Ajax when he came here. Oh, hey. Hey. You get well, I'm, I'm drunk already, man. <laughs> <laughs> the, um, I remember his first game at Ajax when yeah. we played Celtic at the arena yeah. to, to the playoff of the Champions League and he just signed like a couple of days ago we never even knew him we never yeah. knew him and he played as centre back and he was unbelievable yeah. he marked he was like going all over the place uh, after Henrik Larsson and he was man of the match yeah he's just unbelievable I know I know when he came one time in the in the, in the locker room and he could not speak English or only French and he did, did this to me me you <laughs> 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 Hey, she will go to Marina? No, no man. <laughs> You're crazy. You remember your girl? Your, she must, your, be, she your, must be 70 now. No, she's good, she's good looking still. No chance. She uh, was 40 when we played for Ayer. <laughs> <laughs> she have no teeth anymore. <laughs> hey, <laughs> <laughs> no, you remember that? What's no, going? shut up! <laughs> yeah. Fucking hell, man. And the Ferrari? Yeah. <laughs> What's the problem here eh, in Holland? Yeah. When you were 18 years, you buy Ferrari, eh? That's normal. Yeah, it's normal. Not normal for a Dutch guy. No, no, I know. For me, it's okay. Yeah. What did you do? Why, with, why uh, Coleman was so angry? He was so upset. He was, yeah, yeah. He was like, no, no. Why is my Ferrari for us? Yeah, it's my money. I didn't buy yeah. your money. What's wrong with you? Yeah, huh? it's true. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Hey. Ah, but uh, when you know when I got older, yeah, when I started to understand a little bit uh, the Dutch mentality and how people think here, yeah, I could understand where where they come from and where why yeah, they yeah. were happy. They were trying to protect me, but the biggest problem here in, uh, in Holland, Andy, I think that um, in Holland they try to get a boy from a totally different culture yeah. comes from a totally different background yeah. and he, they want him to be Dutch straight away yeah yeah, yeah you know yeah. what I mean don't do stupid things and all that thing. yeah you can't you can't because uh, because you know you when you have a young boy who got a character you should use it yeah because it's 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 a great thing to have a character when you're young mm -hmm. just to find the balance to find this uh, balance of course we were a little bit more crazy than normal yeah but it's a big mistake here in Holland that they, 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 they want the young boys to come in from different countries and to, to act straight away like they've, been, they've been born in Holland. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So that's, that's, that's the, the biggest problems, the, the biggest problems that most of the foreigner boys... <laughs> you know this potato out again? <laughs> uh, yeah, that's the problem now. Women are getting much more prettier here, man. You? Women. Women, eh? Yeah. yeah. I don't live here, man. It's dangerous for me. Yeah, I live uh, one hour from here. Where? Apodoran. Next to the cows. <laughs> next to the next to, next you. to the donkeys. <laughs> <laughs> next to the camels. <laughs> the camels. <laughs> the, the camel of my ex-wife. <laughs> He's living with me now. She's living with you? No man, of course ah. not. She lives in Italy. But the camel is. Is she still in Italy? The camel toe. Yeah, she is she still spending your money? <laughs> your, your <ex> <laughs> money. <laughs> <laughs> still paying? No, 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 still, no. I've, I've finished paying, man. I, stopped, I paid in one go. I remember I met you and you were like, my my, my missus, she's buying camels and she's buying zebra and she's buying... Yeah, I know. What's that? that I don't you know. You made her like that? She's fucking twins with a camel. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but you remember your, your neighbor? Which one? The neighbor. In yeah, she liked you. <laughs> 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 yeah, your missus, she, yeah. she's gonna kill her. Huh? Your missus, she was gonna kill her. Yeah, I know. <laughs> hey, but did she get me then? No. Yes, she did. Yeah? Yes, she was like, she, she went to her and she called her and she was like, 
if you, if you come near him again, I'm gonna kill you and this shit. Was it there? Yeah, I don't remember. You were, man. you were scared like a pussy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were crying. I can't remember. My, my, my missus called me. Hey, you know what I did one time? It was really stupid. <laughs> I was. Look at that there. Eh? You've been there a long time ago. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at this nice one there. Eh? Should we go? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I'll go back later. Yeah. When, I, when, I, when I wanted to go there, they thought I was underage. They wouldn't let me in. No? He said, no, you're not 18. I said, fuck off. I'm <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Fucking hell. Hey, but the, what they didn't want to say. Oh, yeah, one time I remember. This girl, I was I was, I was, was calling with her, but without the number, you know? So <laughs> she said to me, why don't you give me your number? She was asking all the time. And uh, we were playing AZ away. I was sitting in a hotel and I was calling her and she said, give me your number. I said, all right, fuck off then. I said, here, this is my number, you know. I give the number. I give the number of my wife. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Because it was, it was always in my head, you know, the number. I didn't know my own number. So I said, I said, okay, this is my number. So my wife called five minutes later. Hey, what the fuck is this? Hey, this is a girl is ringing me. She said, she has, she's in love with you and all that shit. I said, fuck off, man. She, I said, how did she get the number then? She said, yeah, of you. I said, you fucking stupid. You think I would do that? You know? <laughs> no, no, I don't think. <laughs> uh, oh, man. So you gave, you gave your wife's I, number to a girl? Yeah. Oh, uh, I was so stupid because he was doing my head in all the time, you know, calling me uh, uh, for saying, give me your number, give me your number. I said, no, man, no, I don't want to give you a number. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> oh, oh, man. man. And, but, uh, I can't believe you're still alive. How was that? that <laughs> 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 Tell that story with okay. Slata, with the, with, the, with the scissor. The, with the scissor, come on, man. That's a nice story. But come on, everyone think that, uh, so you think a scissor would kill Slata? A scissor. He wouldn't kill Slatan. <laughs> if man. you hit him right, no. you die. No, man. <laughs> you hit, you hit him in the nose. <laughs> <laughs> it's better. I, I wanted to get his nose a little bit smaller. <laughs> nah. A, when a, was a, scissor, a scissor would never kill Slatan. No. Never. Not that scissor. No. Not that scissor. It wasn't the sharp scissor. They, they made the story, yeah, of, course, of course it's wrong. They made the story like, uh, like, uh, like. You uh, wanted to kill him. Yeah. They liked it here in the media. Yeah. Yeah, but ten minutes later, as you know, we were, we were alright. I know, I know that. But <laughs> what did Kuma say to you? Go away. <laughs> Kuma said to you. No, yeah. Kuma was scared. <laughs> no. He was scared. He, he said, he, he ran, he ran out of the room. Yeah, yeah but yeah. then he said, let <laughs> them go. You have to go. Eh? You have to go. Go away. And you know what you did? I think. <laughs> normal people go home. You went to the airport. <laughs> Fly to Egypt. <laughs> <laughs> you remember when you put your Ferrari one one I time put, on I put short it for, four days? Yeah, in short, on short sh park. Short park. Yeah, and you know what? The, the great thing. No. I came back and it wasn't locked or anything. It was just there. Yeah, it was no fire, there? nothing. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I left it there for four oh. days. They knew it was your car. That's why. No, they just. I didn't. I. I. I think. Like your wife, she never thought that you're stupid to, to, to give her number to any girl. Yeah. The police never thought that that any stupid guy would leave his car there yeah. for four days. Yeah. So they just thought I was inside for 10-15 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> on luck. Yeah. It was on luck. Yeah, oh. I just left it there. You remember one time when the engine was blown? You blew up, you blew up the, the engine, you give the car to me, you went to Egypt and you drive my car. And then I come, you don't remember? One you, time. Yeah, you fucked my car. No! Yeah, you fucked my Ferrari, I remember I gave it to you one time and you broke the gearbox. You fucking stupid. You remember? I gave you the car. I, I want to go up. Uh, uh, you know, you know I, what happened here in Lights Plain? No. So Zlatan said to me, Mido, I got, you know, I'm going out with this Miss Bikini girl from Sweden and this shit. And I was go, like, okay, no You're problem. right here? Huh? You cannot go right anymore. Oh, yeah. No, you can't, man. No, no bro. It was here. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So he said, uh, and back then, before I bought a Ferrari, I had a Z8. You remember yeah, from James yeah, yeah. Bond? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Zlatan said, yeah, please give me your car. I go and pick her up from the airport. You know, I go out with her because I, uh, I told her I have a lot of money here and this shit. <laughs> so I said, okay, no problem. Take the car. And he had a fucking Mitsubishi, you know, gallant. <laughs> <from the laughs> me too, me too. <laughs> you know? So he gave me his car. And by luck, I just, he, and he took my car and I said, okay, the next day you give it to me or two days later you give it to me. So anyway, I came to this little park to park my, the, the Zlatan's Mitsubishi. Oh yeah, yeah, little parking here. Little yeah. park. And I found my car there, the big BMW this day, I found it there. So I knew Zlatan was at one of these coffee shops over there. With, not the coffee shops, you know, the restaurants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Palladium or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I walk in and Zlatan is sitting there next to 
unbelievable girl. He's sitting next to her like that, and he has the the the, the, the key of the BMW of the Z8. On the table. He has it on the table, and he's sitting on that. And I just come in, I sit, I have a drink with him, I swap keys and I leave. No. <laughs> so, the, so the girl was like, hey, what are you doing? I said, this is my fucking car. This car is the Mitsubishi, you're gonna go home with me, you fucking bitch. I'm going home with my car. And you should see the face of Zlatan. He's like, you fucking bastard. <laughs> and one time he had also a girl, uh, Mustala the name, eh? Yeah, Do you yeah, remember? Yes. And he sent me his friend to his house. He, he got his, his friend. And the Turkish guy yeah, got yeah, him to yeah. sleep in the good garage. It, good it. Yeah, he got him to sleep in the garage because <laughs> he didn't he didn't want <laughs> he didn't want the girl to know that this guy is his friend. <laughs> <laughs> so hey, the guy it was I'm freezing <laughs> at two o'clock in the morning. The guy knocked on my door. We told him, said, "It's not to kick me out of the house." I said, "What's for?" Yeah, because he thinks I'm too ugly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's crazy! Oh man. man, we were crazy. You know what we used to do? Mm. Me and Zlatan, yeah. we used to go out to the city. Yeah. We were 18. We were just mad. We had we had lots of money, Young, and yeah, we were yeah. 18. We were like like unbelievable, and. Uh, we used to go to the city and we used to, to take taxis back home and don't pay them. <laughs> Just get out of the car and run. No. <laughs> yeah, said, yeah. And the driver would run after us. Oh, come on. And we were fucking quick. <laughs> Look at the driver and us. So you have a lot of money and then you get a taxi you fucking run. Yes. Just because you're... Yeah. And we were throwing the... When we were younger, we were throwing the bikes and the canals. No. We got the bikes and the... Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, we were mad. Stupid. Yeah, because you're young then. You don't think... You know. We were 18. We would yeah. take it as a joke. We were taking everything as a joke. You know, it's very danger dangerous to get money when you're too young, yeah. to get a lot of money. You drive a little around and then go back. Yeah, it's very dangerous. It's not, uh, it's, it's, if you're not prepared for it, it's, it's, yeah. it's very dangerous. Imagine when, I you're se if I, imagine when you're 17, when I was 17, I already had 1 million euro in my account. Yeah. Because we, we were, we was just so good. People, when you were 17 years old, yeah. When I was 17 and a half, I, have, I had already 1 million euros. And that's in, in, in 2000. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because all the clubs wanted us, all the clubs, so we we could sit and and, and yeah, negotiate yeah, and do whatever we want. So yeah, if you get if you don't get the right management, if you don't get the right people around you, it's so dangerous. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah. It is true. It is true, man. Because you're only you, you're just a kid and you got a million dollars. Oh, come on, baby, come. <laughs> We're driving you later. <laughs> Fuck idiot. Go. <laughs> <laughs> This guy looks like Galasek. <laughs> hey, you speak to any of the players? You still speak? I speak to Zlatan from time to time. Yeah? I speak to Maxwell. I saw Maxwell actually two weeks ago. Maxwell's good. Dude. I see Maxwell a lot. Yeah? Yeah. Where is he? Paris Saint-Germain? He's PSG, yeah. I see Maxwell a lot and I just saw him with the FIFA Congress. He was sitting next to me. Maxwell is a nice boy. Yeah, he's good man. Good man. I wish... Uh, Max was so nice, I wish my kids just become like him. Yeah. He's yeah. just a Gentle, nice, eh? Yeah, such a nice guy. And never big, talk big mouth. And never no, no, very quiet. And he was an unbelievable player. He yeah. was like, he never oh. gave the ball away. No, I know, man. If I play against, with him, against him, I did fuck nothing. I could stop training. He was always good to, too good for me, you know? Yeah, he never oh, gave the ball away. Fucking hell, man. And he could keep the ball. And he, I remember sometimes he was playing at, in the midfield also. He was so good. He never gave the ball away. No. Never gave the ball away. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, you, remember, you remember the cup final? In, I don't know which year it was. Yeah, Utrecht. 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 Yeah, Utrecht. Against Utrecht in the Kuip. Yeah, in the final. Yeah. And we were like, I scored the first goal. Yeah. And Mambeto. But we remember, we were like, this game was like five or six days after we won the league. Yeah. And we were like partying for four or five days and we couldn't run in this game, we were fucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were, yeah, 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 yeah. You remember or not? Oh yeah, I remember. I remember. I, went, I, could, I remember it at the warm up at this game. I could smell champagne. <laughs> <laughs> when, when the players started to sweat, I could. And, oh. and then, and then the 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 we, I scored the first goal, and it was full. The stadium was full. It was full house. Yeah. And then Utrecht they, they scored 
two goals. They were two one till the last minute. And Humberto, he scored. You, you made the assist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You played. And Humberto was like, honestly, like he was three yards offside. <laughs> and, and, oh. and then, and this was last minute, huh? Yeah. And everyone ran after Humberto to celebrate. And I ran after the linesman and I hugged him. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And he, was, and he was like, get away, you fucking bastard! <laughs> yeah, did you? Yeah, yeah. Exactly. He was like, oh, was, because I could see it's fucking yeah, offside. Yeah, yeah. It's two yards offside. Yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. And I went to the linesman, and I, I cannot believe that there is no picture of it. Yeah, I went yeah, to the yeah. line, I went to the linesman, and I hugged him. I jump, I jump over him, and he was like, go away, you bastard! <laughs> I lose my jump. <laughs> <laughs> he was from Ajax. <laughs> no, I don't know. Him. No, no. I don't know. Him, no, but he was I know, man. And then, and then Slater scored a eh? golden goal. Z yeah, Z Z Z Slater Z came in. I think. Came on, yeah, yeah. yeah. He hit the crossbar, and this game, you know. All the supporters were gone already, yeah, from Ajax. They went home. They thought they'd be lose. You know what? This is one of the happiest moments in my career, you know why? Mm. Because the Utrecht players, they were already celebrating. Yeah, 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 and, yeah. and they were celebrating on the pitch and they were, you know, they had their guy at the right back with the long hair. Yeah. Freven, Freven. Yeah, Freven. Stein he, Freven. Yeah, he was like coming to me, doing to me like that. Like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm so happy he with was, him. Wait, he was doing that when it was 2 0 for them. He went to It was 2 1. Yeah. 2 1. Yeah, he came to me and he was like, he came, he, came, he came to me and he was like, uh, and he was like, you know, teasing me. Okay. And I was so happy. I was just so happy. It's just amazing. Football is amazing. Yeah, it's cool. But uh, he's, and, uh, we remember when we, we uh, played uh, NEC away, when we get champion. You give the pass to me, yes. the assist. I scored and you scored. Yeah. yeah. It was unbelievable celebration back in Amsterdam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. unbelievable. Because I, remember, I think Ajax back then didn't win the league for three, four years mm -hmm. when we when I, when we came, huh? Yeah, I think yeah, maybe two, three years, one, three, three or four years. years didn't win it. Eh? No. We didn't win it. Eh? It was a g great days. Yeah. But you know, I came back to Ajax again in 2010, and uh, I was coming from a long injury, and then it took me time to get back fit, mm -hmm. and I started to play and scored some goals. I think I scored like four goals in five games. Mm -hmm. But of course, I wasn't the same player. I was different, but I could I could score goals because I, I, I knew what I was doing. I had enough experience yeah. because I played in higher level and I could I knew what I was doing. And Frank De Boer at the end was like, you know, he was like asking me to, 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 to stay and go to the winter break for the camp. But I just felt I just felt that it w if it's not Ajax will to want me to stay, yeah. because Martin Jorl has resigned, uh, and Martin, who, 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 he's the one who brought me in. Yeah. And I thought, and I, I, you know, I, I thought it would be unfair to stand in the way of a young kid. Okay. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You want to give him a chance, and that's why you left. Yeah, I just okay. said to myself, I know people maybe won't believe that, but this is the honest truth. Okay. I honestly th thought that. You know, I'm not fitting in. Even the people, even the people want me to stay and that. Yeah. I'm not fitting in. I think a young, a young lad would get the chance mm -hmm. and start his career. Would be much better. <clears throat> and who was the guy? The little guy. The little. Then when you uh, left. I don't remember. Oh. I don't remember. But uh, you know, I'm happy now that Ajax. They got a good mix between good young players and some experienced players. Yeah. Because you don't win anything with only young players. You remember back then when we were, we were there, we had Richard Vichka around us, we had Jarl Littmanen around us, we yes. had Aaron Winter around us. We had uh, some players who could guide us, who could, yeah, right. even if they are not playing. Just being there in the dressing room is very important with the young boys. I remember Jarl Littmanen sometimes, he could, he come to me and say, Mido, I want to go have dinner with you. Mm -hmm. And he talked to me and he said, don't do that, don't do that. Richard Vichka, the same, Aaron Winter. This is very important. Yeah. So now I'm happy that Ajax got uh, some experienced players in Daily Blind and Huntelaar and, mm -hmm. and some of the experienced boys who can guide the young kids. Yeah. This is very important. I think it's great. Yeah. It's like it's they become like the mentors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mentors. It's important. Go to... Uh, no, go tell to the them only the story about the scissor. The scissor. I said. Because, no, you said... But what happened then? Because no, it was, was, it was a regular wondering. argument on the pitch. You know what happened. Yeah, and then you came in the locker room? Yeah, it was a regular argument. That I was like telling that and you have to press and he was like like yeah, but, yeah, but, yeah. I, but I was upset that they didn't start the game. It was against PSV I think. Yeah, we it was lost, PSV. We yeah. lost two 0 
and you were cutting yeah and then i went in i went into the dressing room and i was like you you none of you are enough men to win any football games and that i was upset yeah yeah and then Zlatan, he said to me yeah you do you don't talk <laughs> <laughs> hey, but you lost weight, eh? Yes. Oh, how come, eh? I saw one time one picture of you, eh? I, got, I, I put on a lot of weight, eh? How I, come? Yeah, when I retired, it was just, you know, with 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 the ups ups and downs of the of the eternal. Next one, next one. Ah, okay. Back uh, there? Yeah. With the ups and downs of, 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 the, of, the, of the job, you know, becoming a coach. Just eating and it's yeah. just... Uh, don't train eat, anymore. Yeah, eating at night. And your body is used to, to burn certain calories. You don't burn it anymore. Hey, you dress nice now, huh? When you were young, you only had tracksuits on. Now, good man. You... I never had tracksuits on. <laughs> you sponsored? I had long hair. <laughs> yeah. You have sponsor? No. With your clothes for television? No. Hmm. Whatever, whatever. Sherbib, hello. Sherbib? 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 Here, yeah, park here. No, no, leave it for them. Fucking hell, this one hundred euro fucking park here. Cheeky bastards. Uh, no, put it on my room. Oh, no, man. No. Yes, put it on my room. No, man.